Mm. Let's go freaking shopping. What's going on here? There are monsters everywhere, and does the air feel off? How is it that you're here? Have you been following us? Well, I consider returning to Grand Trad. I reckon passing through would be a shortcut, and it felt safe considering you lot took this way as well. <laughs> Seems right foolish in hindsight. There's something bad up ahead. Mark my words. I think I'll head back. <laughs> but you're continuing on this way, I take it? If there's anything you need, I'll be here a bit before I set off. Medicine. Ice chunk. Oh, Ooh. chunk. Oops. Ice damage. More, what, more power. More power. Oh, okay. Freaking more power and freaking much more power. Mmm. Mm. I am so poor. I am less poor. Alright. Good to have that. If you do more damage, maybe you won't need the other stuff. Smash your I was about to say, Plus maybe he's not. He's not freaking attacking with his basic attack. Magic plus one, though. Strength plus one, endurance, and agility. Maybe to the dude. The... I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. Friggin'. He only has five of those in his pocket. Okay. But I can't freaking afford any. I think this is enough of a sign to cut my ties with the uh, illicit mining. Once I return to Grand Trade, I'll set up. I'll set a new bed. I'll get a new venture up and running. You lot take care too. I reckon you have lots going on, but I wish you the best of luck. Much obliged. Safe journeys. Hey, you found something. Let's be a fucking poor people at boring. This is an S and T game. No, not technically an SMT game, but it's basically an SMT game. Alright, freaking. Definitely freaking need. Should have freaking got those ice chunks when I got the chance. I also don't have like any freaking MP, so that's not great. Well done, my friend. Come on! Oh, I, I, freaking, I thought it said, hey, if you sneak up on an enemy without being detected, you can instantly break them. That was a fucking lie. Damn. But that was a fucking lie. Let's go. No holding back. Oh, of course oh he my missed. god. Yep. Damn. Good. Now we miss. Or now we now we dodge. That was not good. No need to rush through. Now, what's the play? Not guard. Oh, you have enough for one of the ice things now. Do I though? Yeah, you do. Because it's 50. It was 250. It was 250. It was 250. But you still have enough. So I'm good. Do I? You have enough for some. Oh no. Oh, never mind. There I you thought go. I was mad. There you go. <laughs> no, the, I want the bigger number to be the money number. Eyes. They sometimes work. Shut up. How many different farm MP? All right. I freaking I farmed freaking MP. We got a couple of extra levels out of it, which I guess is nice, but I freaking not really what I was going for. But this is fine. I feel confident enough to go fight the boss. I bought three ice gems. We have seven fairy medicines, which heal 50 to the party. So I have freaking 
good party healing for AoE attacks. <clears throat> freaking Brius does Tower Kaja so I can freaking buff my mat, my freaking attack. Wait, wait, something feels really wrong further in. It might be what I it might be what I was sensing. Unfortunately, we've got no choice but to press on, regardless of what lies ahead. I'm going to open it. Are you ready? Let's go. Good to hear. Let's go. Wonder what's behind door number? Fuck. I'm terrifying. I don't like that. A bird person? With glasses. Friggin'. Just living it up. I can see the glow of a strange crystal. And an even stranger monster in front of it. What is that? I've never seen anything like it. Oh. That's a human. Uh, look at that fucking bird person. It's dead. Homo fulquillo. Y fulquillo. No, OBS is connected. Yes. Weak to fire? Nope. Probably weak to wind. Concentrating. Bringing the front row is being targeted. Resist wind. That ain't great. Weak to ice? No, nah, weak to ice. Good. So I think I can freaking stack it up to three times. Nobody's in the freaking front row. Bonfire your vanities. I mean, hit nobody. Nice. Attack and defense rows dramatic. Increase the defense for one enemy for three turns. You know what's up, Diggs? Bot. Hello, Diggs. Oh shit! Big damage, powerful strike. Gabot. Yeah, and there's the AOE. But wait, they freaking missed. They missed somebody. Again. What? What do you mean, no damn? That's good. We got freaking fairy dusts for this. If we're just such a casual. Not bad. Piper. Freaking concentrating. Front row is being targeted. 
This is fine. So we're just gonna freaking kill him this turn. Easy enough. Learn new skill. I can do electric damage now. Nice. Magma would just determine this. And my death. The monsters were drawn before us. We should have made something so sinister just lying around. Grand Eye. We definitely freaking need like some tower kaja and stuff. Freaking just full party buff stuff. Oops, I'm not. Uh, I didn't want to bring something here, but I will. Oh, hey, they're weak now. Hey, they're freaking weaker than me now because I leveled up. Freaking yay. Now they're freaking blue. It's going to be good. Now we can freaking run through here and get a freaking boatload of our MP bay. Okay. Easy enough. <laughs> Thanks. I try. Oh, these things drop magma pills. Also, super nice to farm. Okay, let's proceed. Oh, excuse me. Okay. Make a save. And mosey. Alright, so we slayed the Magma Crystal. Going further into the mines. Not a great look. Talk about some sort of big freaking presence around her. <laughs> hey, do you see that? Oh, yeah, don't fuck that thing up. What is that? Just look at the size of it. Not something I'd hope I'd ever stumble upon. I'm afraid that's a dragon. A dragon? You mean those creatures from the legends? I've never seen one with my own eyes. Now I don't understand why the mine was closed. They must have dug right into this thing's roost and had no choice but to back off. The mine taps a magnificent vein of resources. Only something as terrible as a dragon could have forced them to abandon such a lucrative operation. 
Luck is on our side that we've caught it slumbering like this. We can slip past it and continue forward. Almost a shame. It has all sorts of things in a little, well, big nest. I can sense something tinged with magla, too. Dragons are ancient, and strong magla follows in their wake, just the way it goes. Any so-called special item you're sensing is bound to have its fill of it. You're making it sound kind of appealing, but we're sure to end up in a fight if you try to take it. Don't make this decision lightly, Metaphor. On that note, let's push on. Quietly now. I do mean that. We wake that thing up, we're in for the fight of our lives. But there's monsters around here, too. Aye, if they see us and cause a ruckus, then we're done for. Keep your distance from them as we make our way through. Understood? Good, let's go. Obviously, I'm playing them. What do you think you're doing? Not good. On your guard now, it comes for us. I want that item. Alright, we're gonna fire dragon mana. Nice crit. Oh, I should bring heal up more. Big damage. Oh, damn. I'm scared he's gonna bring you the fight or attack, so freaking I knew it. I freaking knew it. I can work with that. Again, I can bring work with that too. Not bad, not bad. No, there's no need to rush this. Good thing I freaking guarded. Because he's freaking, so he's freaking, looks like freaking scratch, scratch, fireball, fireball. Not bad. Oh shit. Oh shit, Hail's white. Hey, I got all this fairy dust. Okay, 
Okay, I can work with that. Can't work with that, though. Okay, that's fine. Okay, two hits on the resistor. To rush this. After you. Got the dragon. Yeah. Easy peasy. It does feel good to get strong. Not crew. What was he freaking guarding? That was close. Somehow, you managed to drive it off. Never thought I'd ever have to fend off a dragon. You lot never cease to amaze me. Freaking triple mage is probably the way to go. Just ice spam. Perhaps we simply had luck on our side this time. I must admit, however, that my heart sank the moment the dragon woke up. If anyone truly intends to kill the beast, they need to have a gauntlet runner. A gauntlet runner would certainly make our return to Grand Trad much easier. You may as well wish for the moon. Only the most prominent nobles have the means to secure a runner for themselves. Sorry to interrupt, but over there, isn't that a treasure chest? Yeah, and it's fucking good shit. Grand iron. Glossy fur. Onyx. Is and that the summon? What? Oh, that's not the summon. Okay. Incredible. Dragon's indignation. Oh, great A great sword. sword embodying the fury of a dragon. Slash can be purified at a church. And that is a freaking substantial bower boost. Substantially strong. Yeah, freaking beat the dragon with minimal issue. Look. Look, isn't that the exit? It is. We can finally get out of here. Looks like we can finally breathe easy, at least for a moment. What? Oh no, could it be? Uh oh. What? A dragon's roar? And you feel that shaking, right? Getting stronger. What's going on here? No. No, stop. Caven, if you value your lives, run! Oh, well, I'm running. If I freaking don't run, I die. Hurry. I'm hurrying, goddamn. Hurry. I made it. Still going, though. Ah, oh, this is so cozy. 
I'm still alive again. Yes. It's certainly better than freezing. Reminds me of when I was a child. Back then, I wouldn't have been caught dead out in the wilderness like this. Countryside nobility like us had no fortune to speak of. My parents bowed and smiled for their money, and honestly, I despised them for it. Back then, I thought being a noble was about, I don't know, a life of prestige, being respected. But one spring, seven years ago, our town was attacked by this horrific creature. A human. Though I had no idea at the time. I was evacuated alongside the servants while the rest of the town burned. I waited for my parents to join us in the shelter. But they would never come. Mm. The parents I had so despised had stayed behind to protect the villagers who couldn't feed them. They were heroes. Their parents were heroes. It changed everything. It taught me who my parents really were. What it really meant to be a noble. But our town's just rubble now. A footnote in history. The human that destroyed us is all we'll ever be known for. I remember my father petitioning the capital for aid, but no reply came. Even knowing how much of a threat the humans were, now I think, what if the army, well, at least, what if he's the one who abandoned us? If we were just a pawn in his game, then, then I will make him pay. Oh, we will. We all trust each other now, don't we? Yes. Then we can pay him. Why? Maybe you're right. I admit the lad saw through the remains of the past. Something special about that sword? Well, we use it to identify the messenger from our faction. But it originally belonged to his highness. A kingly gift from his father. To better suit his highness and his keen aptitude for magic, that blade was specially forged with raw magma pulled into the metal. Of course, when Swordplay bore them, he could amuse himself by levitating it or standing atop it to glide about. <laughs> A royal rascal, that one. Mm -hmm. The old days were all too short. Then, well, years ago, it all came crashing down. I heard the prince was attacked, but there was a plot in his life. One I wish I could have figured out sooner. Just like tonight, it was pouring rain. Your Highness, this way! Oh damn, it's getting crazy. Anime got some. Look at him go, Grias, go! Oh shit. Oh. Beauty L. My lord, are you hurt? Hi. A royal knight. A wench and nothing more. Damn. Him up. Beat this. See that's beaten. Damn. Curse. Freaking, you knew we were gonna freaking beat the ass. Doesn't matter. Damn, nice. You freaking at least got him. He's beating the ass. He didn't get the kill though. And he got away. Warp portation magic. Potent. Good. There's the door. His highness survived the attack, but the curse had no endless power over his contents. For 
all the new heroes in the capital, not one of you will get in. And if you're a new killer who keeps passing through, you might look to us as the nearest descendants of his followers, but we will never get back up. The dreams are long made, and if a spell that comes, this caster must die. And you'll surely reach the commanding chief. I saw him in the way. He was younger than me. Younger even than you are now. I'm sure of him as I was. I would never mistake him. I know. After spilling the royal blood of his father and son both, the people call him not traitor, but savior for his eyes. For the king, and for the very future of this country, he must take the others to kill me. So as he did with the prince, he will make of my city a stepping stone to further heights. A tool to spread the infamy of the thieves. You haven't told that story to me, have you? Thank you. I trust in your love. Your love never forgets a debt. <laughs> it's three generations to see the day. <laughs> Neither will you forget a grudge. The least will know that soon enough. Yeah. This is about. Yep. Frank, this mission means a lot to you too, doesn't it? Yes. Of course it does. You've been carrying a grudge along to my room, right? Indeed. In any case, I owe you my life. And we've both got something we fight to protect. Let's save this country. Together. Together. Uh, ideally, once we're out of this cold, of course. Of course. It's about time we eat. We're almost to the capital, after all. I'd say that's worth celebrating. I agree. I'm exhausted. 